is reviewing a blood pressure monitor for you today. I'm in the bathroom because this is where we take our blood pressure readings in this house. Um, my husband has high blood pressure and his doctor advised him to take it first thing in the morning before being too active. So once he gets out of bed, he comes in here, sits down and takes his blood pressure prior to getting dressed, showering, using the bathroom, anything like that. So that's why it's in here. Um, I will show you up close. We have a start stop button in the middle here. Um, memory to, cause you can store readings in here and set to play with the settings. Um, what I like is this machine will speak out loud and walk you through the steps to take it as well as it will say out loud what your readings are. So if you are vision impaired and have a hard time reading the numbers, it's going to say it out loud so you can see and hear your readings and know that they are normal or not. The other thing I like is that the cuff is able to put on all by yourself. You don't need help. It also has some reminders on how to put it on. It shows you that the tube right here should be on the side where your hand is, not the side where your shoulder is. And on the inside, there's markings showing where the artery is so you know which way to have it turned. So I'm going to unvelcro, and it's already looped in the cuff. So I'm just going to make sure, like the diagram says, that the tubing is down here towards my wrist, not my shoulder. And this right here says artery mark and has a circle with a line through it. And that is what I'm going to line up right here in the middle of my arm where the artery is. It also says OK right here so that you know, like, you can read it right here if this is an OK placement. And then I'm going to grab this excess here and velcro it and easy to put on by myself. And then I'm gonna hit start on here and it's gonna walk me through taking it with reminders on how to properly sit while having your blood pressure taken. Press remain seated and refrain from talking during measurement and keep the cuff at your heart level. Cuff at heart level. So you can see here too that there's a little green light because that's a normal reading. If it's too high, it will have a red light there so that you know it's abnormal in case you're not very familiar with where the numbers should be for you. Um, these are very normal numbers for me. Even that pulse rate, I have a fast heart rate. Um, but these are all very normal. I like that it says it out loud. I can read this, but if I didn't have my glasses on, I probably wouldn't even be able to read the numbers on here, but I would still be able to hear it. Um, I also have this set as user number one. You can set it to record numbers for two users, so that's really great. But like I said, my favorite part is that it does tell you out loud. It reminds you to keep your cuff at your heart rate, keep your feet on the floor and sitting and not talking. Um, and then I really like that this is really easy to do on and off by yourself with no help. Also, there's like a little, I don't know, it's a smushy <laughs> little stopper in here so that this won't just easily come undone. So you can have it nice and big and come around. It's going to fit a very large arm or a very small arm. So very good um, kind of generic size fitting cuff that's going to fit your skinnier and heavier patients. Um, it's going to walk you through it, tell you your readings out loud as well as on the monitor, give you the reminder light so you know if it's a good or high reading, um, the reminder of where to put the, the tubing and where to face it for the artery. So I really like that this is a very basic layman's 
blood pressure cuff. Um, so if you're not overly comfortable with medical devices and things, this is really going to keep it nice and simple and easy for you. Um, so there you go. I hope that helps.